Howdy guys, it's me Gaming Do, and welcome to another GeoGuessr video. And today we are going to be going around again for four rounds just like the last time and we're starting off with the United States map and I know we're going to be doing another unique map that we haven't done before. I'm going to do two United States, one world and something else but i'll pick up on that in a second anywho let's get on with it round one which is going to be united states so if we're anywhere in the u.s that's kind of are those bison i think those are bison are they wild bison or are they i think they're farm raised because there is a little fence right there I think. Um, to me, this looks like this could be Western Great Plains. Like, it could be the Western part of South Dakota, Nebraska. But it could also be the Eastern part of Colorado or Wyoming or even Montana. Uh... If I was to guess anywhere, I'd still guess we're in the Midwest, but just barely. This could also be, like, Oklahoma or Texas or something like that. I don't think it's Texas. If you look at that plate, that doesn't really look Texas-like. So, this could be Oklahoma? Maybe? Um, we gotta go a little further. Here's a truck that doesn't really give us any hints. We gotta really get close. Ah, uh, don't do this again. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Oh, here's a sign. Uh, of course, that's just a no passing zone. Uh, let's say county. Restlawn Cemetery. Is that the name of the town? Restlawn? Uh, Liberal Kansas, Irving, Texas. Uh, this could be Kansas, too. Yeah, this could definitely be Kansas. Um, as a matter of a fact, I'm kind of going to just lean on this being Kansas. So, oh my god, this is taking 6,000 years. Let's go with Kansas. I think we are ultimately going to go with Kansas for this one. Let's go with it. Just barely. It's almost in Oklahoma, but we just barely got to Kansas. Okay, good. That's awesome. Okay, next. Uh, seems like we're on some sort of premises. Maybe a college? We leave, um, license plate. That might be a Maryland plate, possibly. That's definitely possible. This seems maybe this could be anywhere east of the Mississippi River. Um, I don't think it's the South. I think it's either the Mid Atlantic or Midwest. Um, we're going in a completely wrong direction. But that doesn't really matter. What matters is we find out where we are. Um, let me see. United Dairy Farmers. Uh, it could be the Midwest. Um, area patrolled by aircraft. Adopt highway litter next two miles. Um, okay. If we get, like, an exclusive restaurant type, that might give us the region, at least. Uh, there's a little state park sign. Branch Ricky, um, I don't know where that is. So, I would guess we're either... In, like, the southern or western mid-Atlantic or Midwest. This really seems Midwest. Though, um... 
I'm not a hundred percent certain on that. Here's some flags. That should really it just flew me past the flags, which would have helped. Uh, <laughs> I thought I just saw some freaking flags. Oh yeah, there they are. No, what are you doing? Here we go. Uh, no, of course, none of them are the state flag. Okay, I learned a trick from the last video. Do a majority of the cars have a front plate? Well, there's two that don't. So, if we see some f majority of them front plate, it's a front plate state. Which would rule out a few states. Like, um, let me see, drug activity. Oh, that's the Ohio State Police logo. So this is somewhere in Ohio, okay. Uh, Delaware County, Ohio. Crap, where is that, isn't that? That's not where Columbus... I, that doesn't matter. The point is, this is Ohio somewhere. Alright. I thought that... That's close to Columbus, but not quite. Is Delaware County where Columbus is? I'm not sure. Alright, number three. Uh, palm trees. That looks like the Nevada plate. I think this definitely could be Nevada. I don't know for sure, but... Okay, we're getting pretty bad coverage. Uh... I'm saying maybe not because this is very rural, but then again, Nevada can get very, very rural, so... Uh... New Mexico? I don't think so. I think this is Nevada. Judging by the plates, we're not quite in California. Um, could be Arizona, too? Or New Mexico. This could also be New Mexico, but I don't really see any New Mexico plates. Let's look at this one. Is that possibly a white plate? Uh, maybe? Maybe? It could be Texas. West Texas somewhere. I'm not, I'm not sure. I'm not sure on this one. This could be... My guess is either Texas, New Mexico, Arizona, or Nevada. I'm like 90% sure this isn't California, though. Okay, I'm going to pick a leaning very soon. I'm going to go a little further. This seems like somewhere that would be on the Mexican border, though. So... I don't think these are New Mexico's plates, though. They're like yellow and turquoise. So I would probably go with... Here's a hint. I don't know. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to go with West Texas, because seems like this kind of rules out Nevada, because this seems like a town that's probably close to the Mexican border. So I'm going to go with Southwest Texas. I wasn't kidding, that's right on the freaking Mexican border, and it is southwest Texas, or almost south central, to, uh, not central, um, it, no, it is southwest Texas, okay, I got that right, not the exact same place, but awesome, alright, number four, um, this strikes me as being... New Jersey! 
this is New Jersey, my home state. Okay, um, doesn't really look like in anywhere in New Jersey that I've seen. No, this could definitely be South Jersey. Um, because this is my home state, I want to guess where this is. Um, the houses in North Jersey are generally bigger than the houses in South Jersey, but this is definitely New Jersey. Um, looks like really Southern New Jersey. Um... I could even guess by the county where this is if we just knew the counties. I know all the counties in New Jersey, so... Um... I was to take a guess, where is this? Mercer, this is Mercer County, okay. So this is down by, like, Trenton and stuff like that. I believe pretty soon I'm... Possibly going to Mercer County for... We're going to go see some gardens down in Hamilton, which is pretty cool. I believe we're going there pretty soon, like within the next few months. But, uh, yeah, this is Mercer County, so I'm going to guess down by... I'll go with Hamilton. Go with Hamilton, New Jersey. Go with Hamilton right there. No, it looks like Trenton. Okay. Or Ewing. I I don't know. But Mercer County, New Jersey. I got the county and the state. All right, last part for this round. Um South Point. This is hard. Uh, oh god, I wish I knew. Is that the one for Hawaii? I don't think that's impossible for this to be Hawaii. Volcano Kona. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Hawaii. Okay. Kona, right here, right? So it's the big island? Yes, it's the big island. Okay, awesome. Alright, so that's going to do it for round one. Next round will be another round of World Geography. I'll see you in one second for that. Okay, the first round of the first part of World Geography leads us somewhere into Europe. Um, honestly, this looks very French to me, so I could definitely see this being France. It could possibly be Spain, too, but I am leaning on this being France. The architecture definitely looks more southern French. Yeah, that looks French. Um, could we get any hints? I don't know, but I am leaning on this being France. That's a freaking beautiful castle. Look at that. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these are the French signs, too, that you see around France. Um, so... I am gonna guess France. I think the architecture would be right. The... looks like the French language. I'm terribly sorry, I'm horrible with languages, but I guess by, like, the architecture and the landscape um i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to give myself one last hint if we can look here definitely looks french i think this is france somewhere uh it doesn't really i'm gonna guess southern france because it seems like france no <laughs> it's on the exact opposite end of the country but it is france okay good it was way northern France, almost by, like, the English Channel. So, yeah. Alright, there's round one. Round two, we seem to be in Europe again. I would say Germany, but I don't think Germany gets that much coverage on Google Maps. 
But this looks kind of German. So maybe this is Poland? Possibly? I don't think that's impossible. Uh... Bike sign, if we could get a language, I'm probably not going to be able to guess by the language, but I think there's a bit of a difference between German and French. Alright, don't do this again, come on. This thing decides to go at any speed it wants and it's annoying. Okay, look at that. Uh, yeah, this is probably somewhere around... The Germany Poland area. Uh, if I was to guess, I'm probably gonna lean on Poland. I don't know, might be Scandinavia too? Doesn't really look like the Scandinavian architecture though. So, my guess is going to be Poland. I'm gonna go a little further in first. And we'll see from there. Ah, here's like the center of where we are. Maybe. I don't know. Hotel Duplex. Garage Macron. Macron. Is this France again? Are we in France for the second time? Macron's the Prime Minister of France, so... Oh my god. Maybe not. I don't know, this could be... Gosh, I am stumbled on this one. That looks like... The flag you'd see in... Uh, Switzerland. So, now I'm Switzerland, Poland... Germany... France... Ultimately, I probably that... The verbal hint seems to lean on France again, but I will probably be wrong on that one. Let's get a look at one last sign, and then we will guess from there. Okay, here we go. I'm going to guess France for the second time. Is it France again? It is France again, okay. Nice. I can't believe we got France twice in a row. Cool. All right, let's see, next. Okay, this is 99.9% .9 not Europe. My guess is this is Latin America somewhere. Ah. This is really nice. Oh. Let me. Oh no, you know where this is? This is in the United States of freaking. Don't say that automatically. Because. There is a slight possibility this could also be somewhere in. Well, let's look at the license plates. This could be, like, New Zealand or Australia, too. But I am leaning on this being... South Florida somewhere, maybe. Well, it's gonna look... But that doesn't quite look like the Florida plate. Uh... No, I don't think this is the United States. Where could this be, then? I don't think this looks like Oceania, either, though. It's English. There's a country in South America that speaks English. Maybe this is Guyana. I think this is Guyana, but I don't know if it gets too much coverage. But... I'm honestly gonna go with... Guyana. Guyana? Where? Malaysia? Or Singapore? Is Singapore an English-speaking country? I didn't think so, but okay, wow, okay. 
Yeah, I can see it. A little bit of an Asian architect. It actually doesn't really look all that Asian. But... Maybe a little bit. I don't know. Let's go to our next round. France again, right? No. No. Okay, this is the United States. My guess is... Out west somewhere, for sure. Uh... Where is this? This is America somewhere, but I want to guess the state if it's going to be America, because I know more about my home country than most other countries, so... Uh, potentially, I see this either being California or Nevada. I'm actually leaning on Nevada for this one. Specifically because if you look in the distance, it kind of looks like there might be a small casino there. Let's look at the plate. If the plate's bluish... Then it's probably Nevada. If it's all white, then it's probably California. Uh... That being said, there's also a pretty big mountain. But Nevada definitely has its mountains. Not as much as some states. Uh... This could be Utah as well. Utah is a possibility. Oh, uh, gosh. Um, is this impossible to be in Canada as well? Maybe. Maybe this is Canada somewhere? I don't know. It doesn't look all that Canadian, though. Uh, Petco. I don't think that's in Canada. I'm pretty sure that's only in America. And... Barnes and Nobles, too. I'm pretty sure Canada has Best Buy. Uh, so my three leanings are... It seems like that blue plate, so I think it's Nevada. Yeah, this looks like somewhere you'd see in maybe northern Nevada, close to Lake Tahoe, maybe? I don't know. But I am definitely leaning on with that being a blue plate. This is somewhere out west. It's probably Nevada. I'm not quite there yet, but I am 90% sure this is Nevada. Uh, that being said, I'm not 100% sure because... It could be a Nevada plate going to some other state. I don't think this is Arizona, right? Maybe? Huh. Okay, we're gonna have to put it somewhere now. Uh, I am leaning on Nevada still. Yeah, it looks like a blue plate, so it would probably be Nevada. Alright, we're going to go with Nevada. I, I'm supposed to guess the country, but that's just way too easy. So we're going to guess Nevada. It is Nevada! Okay, nice. Awesome. I knew it was towards that region, too, by, like, Reno and Lake Tahoe. So, awesome. Okay, cool. And the last for World... Is going to be somewhere. Oh, uh, somewhere. Hmm, probably. Maybe Southern Africa. This could also be Latin America. Latin America, too. This is definitely could be Latin American. This could also be Asian. This could also be... Brazil. Oh, this is probably Brazil. Because that says Brazil. Um, I don't know about that, but this definitely looks like it could be somewhere in Brazil. The architecture looks Latin American. There's... Definitely palm trees in Brazil. 
Uh, Rio de Janeiro. Yeah, this is probably Brazil. Okay, we're going to guess on Brazil. Awesome. Okay. So, I will see you in the next round, which is going to be another United States round. And for the last round, I'll leave it with a little bit of surprise, but I got a hint on what I'm going to do. See you next for round three. Alright, round three starts us in the United States again. We are going to guess somewhere where there's a fair amount of trees. Um, right now I am leaning the upper Midwest. This could also be the lower Midwest, but I'm not sure. I think my main guess is this is the Midwest. It could also be the South, too. If we could get out of this little neighborhood, we would probably be able to guess a little easier. Um, something tells me to lean more Midwest, though. I don't know, like the housing looks more Midwest, but... You can also see some of this housing type down south, too, so. This is a really hard toss-up on if it's southern or midwestern. But something tells me it's, like, possibly Kansas, which we already got. It could be Kansas again. Like, the southern, western, like the southwest, midwest, maybe. This could also be Missouri as well. But this could also be states like Kentucky or Tennessee. I'm almost positive this is an eastern state. Okay, we're getting very f farmland. Um. Again, that could that's both Midwestern and Southern. Have a lot of farmland. But, judging by the fact that I think the housing looks a little more Midwestern, I'm going to guess this is in the Midwest. Uh, where, though? Like I said, either Kansas or Missouri. Um... Whew, okay, um... I'm honestly probably leaning on Kansas, but I'd like to get to some downtown area where they can give us more hints. We're stuck in this little neighborhood. Seems like a quaint, nice little neighborhood at that, but still, I'd like to get to the downtown area so I can take a guess where we are. It seems like we are getting a little more downtown. Casey's, that's almost guarantees the Midwest. I think a few southern states have it, though. Uh, this seems like a real... Well, no, I was gonna say this seems like a really small town, but there's some... Relatively large buildings there. Um, yeah, this definitely looks like a Midwestern type of downtown. There's two Casey's in the same town. Okay. Um, I wouldn't have guessed Iowa at first, but maybe? Uh... Oh, where is that? That's Nebraska, isn't it? Yes, it's Nebraska. Okay, so it is the Midwest. Let's go with Nebraska. Uh-huh. Uh, relatively close to both the Missouri and the Iowa border. Let's go on to round two. Okay. This definitely seems southern somewhere. 
specific, well, the tree's lost its leaves, so maybe not, but I'm, my first guess is somewhere down south. If we look, well, let's, let's start looking at the plates. We should have done that a little more. Um, is that a white plate? Is this Texas? Ah, uh, I don't think it's impossible to be Texas. I I'd actually lean on this being Texas. No, no. No, it's not Texas. It's not Texas, it is Georgia. Okay, cool. So I knew it was somewhere down south. It is Georgia. There we go. Awesome. Uh Huh. Is this Nevada again? Yeah, I think this is Nevada again. You look at the blue plates. It seems like this is Nevada again, but maybe right in Las Vegas? Yeah, bluish plates in a very southern, western neighborhood. Could definitely be Nevada near Las Vegas, or in actual Las Vegas itself. I think that's definitely... Yeah, this is the Nevada plate in this area. Kind of looks like the new Ohio plate, too, which is really cool, actually. But... My guess is Nevada again. I think it's Nevada. Yeah, I'm going to guess actually down by Las Vegas. Awesome. It is Nevada again. I can tell by the plates, like I said. All right. Round four leads us. Hmm. I don't know. What, what, what kind of plate? Is that the Washington State plate? I wouldn't have thought we're that far Pacific Northwest. So I don't think so. But I don't think it's impossible. Uh, my guess is this is probably... Probably... Appalachia? Maybe? Could be Appalachia. I mean, I don't think it's impossible to be the Pacific Northwest either. I don't think it is. No, this isn't the Pacific Northwest, but that did look a little bit like the Washington State plate. So, a lot of really nice houses. Oh, wow, this is a really nice neighborhood wherever we are. Um, I would honestly... I think this might be Washington. This doesn't really... No, this isn't... What? Probably not. I don't know. We're in the downtown... Now I'm leaning a little more New England. What has that... What has that plate in New England? You know where else this could be? This could also be... Rhode Island? Maybe? That's the only plate in New England that I really think... Oh, yeah! No, I think I figured it out. I think we're in Rhode Island. Yeah, there's like the waves on the bottom there. Yeah, this definitely looks more like New England architecture. And New England has a lot of nice houses. So, I could definitely see this being Rhode Island. Uh, Bellarmine University? Yeah, um... This really does look like New England type of 
architecture. Is this right in Providence? I don't think so, but... This seems like one of the bigger towns or cities in Rhode Island. So, yeah, I'm like 90% sure this is Rhode Island now. This does not seem like somewhere you'd see out west. Is that a big building? Yeah. I could see this being right in Providence, Rhode Island. Let's get one last little look at a plate. Just to like 100% make sure. I think it is. I'm probably wrong and it's somewhere in the Midwest. But this really does look like Rhode Island. I'm going to guess. Whoa. Don't go into Massachusetts. Go right into... I'm not in Connecticut. Uh, Providence. There we go. Ready? Let's see. Kentucky? Well, wow, that's embarrassing. Um, this is a really nice... That directly in Louisville? This is really nice. Cool. Um, but... No, we were very wrong. It looked like Providence, Rhode Island, maybe, but it's Louisville, Kentucky. Or generally around that area. Okay, um... Wherever this is... If you live here, you live in a very nice area. Nice. Okay, let's do our final round. Round four, five. Why did I say round four, five? It's round five. Um, palm tree area. New Mexico? Wow. Wait. What did you just say? There's no palm trees where they have a Wawa. Oh, no, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Florida has some... Yeah, that's definitely Florida. Okay. Florida definitely has some Wawas. Not a lot, but they have a few. Yeah, I... I, I, I got confused when we saw Wawa for a second. Coincidentally, about 15 minutes from my house, they just opened a Wawa. Now, in New Jersey, where I live, they have... Tons of Wawa's. In Florida, I don't think they have as many, but they do have some there. Florida has everything. They have Wawa. I believe they have Casey's. They have Culver's. Somehow, Florida gets everything that is, like, non-regional. I'm pretty sure the first state that's gonna get, uh... In and out, out east is probably going to be Florida, even though I don't think they're going to get it. I think ultimately in and out is going to stay out west. But yeah, okay, our answer is Florida. I can't believe that. They still, to this day, I can't believe Florida as Wawa's, but that's cool. All right. Stay tuned for the last round, which I don't know what it's going to be, but I'll come up with something. I'm going to make it a little bit different. Let's go. Okay, for this round, we're going to be doing something very unique. And depending on if it takes a while, I might do one last fifth round for you guys. Which I might do anyways, because I... I feel like we should expand the amount of rounds we do with GeoGuessr every time, but we'll see. Here, I am doing Guess Where I Am by the Country's Flags. So, yeah, let's get started. Basically, we gotta guess where we are based on the country's flags, and I believe this is... Somewhere in the Middle East, I think it's... Not cool. I think it's Bahrain, right? Bahrain? Does Kuwait have a flag like that, too? Gosh, I have that flag. I have a bunch of flags that I ordered online 
not too long ago, and I believe Bahrain was one of them. So I'm going to guess Bahrain? It is Bahrain. Okay, cool. Awesome. That's great. All right. And for such a small country, that's a pretty good guess. So let's guess the next one. Okay, where are we? Uh, there's got to be a flag here somewhere. Uh, Lebanon, right? Maybe? Quite possibly? That's the Lebanese flag right there, but then it looks like there's another flag right there. Well, where are we? I'm gonna lean on Lebanon. Yeah, this seems like it's gonna be kind of quick, so I will probably do a fifth round, but that's besides the point. Looks like maybe Middle Eastern architecture, so I could definitely see this being Lebanon. It looks like it is because that's the flag of Lebanon. Where are we? Lebanon, right here. You tricked me. It's the Republic of the freaking Congo. This is going to be hard, because they're trying to trick you. Okay, it's the Republic of Congo, or the Republic of the Congo. Okay. Well, I saw the Lebanese flag there, and I should guess I should have guessed by the other one. Alright. Look carefully now. Where are we? Where's the flag? <laughs> oh, I don't know. This is harder than I thought it was going to be. Uh, there's your flag, I believe. For the country? I don't know, though. It looks like it. That's the only flag I see so far. There's one in the distance. Definitely not Republic of the Congo. Is that Angola's flag? Maybe? Uh, not Somalia. Not Somalia. It's not Kenya. It's not Tanzania. Uh, I'm like 90% sure it's not Mozambique. And it's definitely not South Africa. Uh. Here's why I'm going to guess Ghana. I don't think it's in Ghana. I don't think it's in Togo, Benin. Gosh. I think this is in Africa. I just get the vibes of Africa with how it's... So, but it could also be the Caribbean somewhere. Or the Caribbean. But I, I don't know. Huh. I die almost lean Africa, though. This looks like... If you really look kind of like the African architecture, I don't know. I'm kind of just saying that because I was in Africa the last time. You know what? I don't think this is it. I am going to guess Togo. Where is it? How in the name of God was I supposed to guess that? You gotta be like... I've only heard of Tonga maybe once or twice? Holy moly, that is... That is... That is... This is hard. Holy crap. The first one was easy. But... This one was actually... Wow... Well, I don't know anybody who would have guessed that correctly. That is a really small island nation in the Pacific. Okay. But that's pretty cool. Alright, anyways, round four. Oh, where is that? Is that Kenya? Yeah, I think that's Kenya. Looks like the Kenyan flag. Uh, I think it's Kenya. 
I'm probably wrong, but I, that is where I'm going to guess. There's also flags in the Middle East that that looks like, but I am leaning on Kenya, just because. But that doesn't seem like there's like a little emblem in the middle like Kenya, but I, I think I'm going to guess Kenya. No, it's South Sudan. Great, I got it wrong. This is a hard round. I only got the first one correct. Let's see if I can get the last one correct. Okay, hopefully so. We're definitely doing another round after this. Oh my god, I know exactly where this is. Okay. Oh, locating it on the map, though, is going to be a bitch. Oh my god, it's even smaller than that. It's the Vatican City. Where is it? Oh, there it is. There it is, right? Vatican City. Vatican City, there we are. Why would you do that? Why? Why would you do that? It's right outside and it... This game is tricking you. You know what? I'm, I'm, it's so close to Vatican City, I'm ultimately going to give myself that one. This round just tricked the hell out of me. It gave me, especially that last one, it made you think you were actually in the Vatican City, but you're actually right on the border, walking distance from the Vatican City in Italy. Oh. <sighs> that almost makes me angry. But, alright, I am going to give you one last round of something just because this was so short, so I will see you for that. Okay, for this last round, I decided that we're going to go down under into Australia. Why? Because I think I'm just good enough to know all the states in Australia, but it would still be a little bit of a challenge to where I'll have to maybe move around a little bit to guess. So, let's get started. Um, something's telling me... This might be... Huh. Probably... Where is that called? The Australian Capital Territory. Some reason I'm going to... I'm guessing there because it seems a little bit hilly. And that's like probably the most mountainous part. But the rest of this area is flat. So that's honestly pretty hard. Australia I picked on purpose to sort of give me a bit of a challenge. But by the signs maybe we can get... Um, window on the Wetlands Visitor Center... Wetlands, hmm. I don't think this is too desertish, so I would guess it'd probably be in Eastern Australia somewhere. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to just take a lucky guess. I know I'm probably wrong. I'm going to guess the Capital Territory. I don't know, but let's see if it is. Yeah, you see, if you get something wrong in Australia, it's really wrong. That is in the Northern Territory, so that it was not very good. Okay. Let's try to do a little better next time. Okay. Um, seems like a relatively populated area. Where exactly? Well... Hopefully we find out. Something tells me this could be one of the suburbs of the cities. Huh. Let's see. Uh. Yeah, Australia's a bit hard. Just because of how freaking big it is and where things could be. Things are a lot further apart from each other than, say, America. 
or even Canada, most of the, a lot of the major cities in Canada are relatively close together. I mean, Vancouver and Toronto are very far, but Vancouver, or Toronto and Montreal are pretty close. So, unlike that, Australia, most of the cities are very far apart. So, if I guess it wrong, I'm probably going to be very wrong. Well, hmm. Wish we had a little bit of a hint. Bower Cottages. Oh, there's a road sign. Huh. Oh, it seems a little bit mountainous, so... believe I'm doing this. I might have to guess the capital territory again. No, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to pick something different. Huh. Yeah, I clearly don't know shit about this. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have picked this, but I think it's a fun last round to go on. Just to give us a little bit of a challenge. Meals on Wheels. Alright, I'm probably so wrong, but I'm going to guess. This probably isn't Sydney. Maybe Melbourne? Huh. Brisbane? I'm just gonna guess Sydney. I know that's stereo... Almost... Just... Terrible guess, but that's my guess. Yeah. Still better than the last one. That is... Adelaide. Okay. Cool. Oh, come on. Yeah, this is hard. This is actually pretty hard if you're not from Australia, I imagine. You're pretty much putting me in a park. Uh... Oh, my. Um... Gosh. Uh, let's take a look at where we might be. Windham history. Is that Windham? I don't know. This seems like it could be West. I'm gonna guess the state of Western Australia. Just because. Oh my. This is how big it is. I got the state and everything right. But because it's on the opposite end of the state and how huge it is, I didn't get a lot of points. That's how freaking massive Australia is. It's massive. But I'll give myself that just because I got the state right. That looks like Western Australia. More of a desert type. Alright, four. This seems to be a bit of a different region. Um... I hate to do this, but I I don't know if we're going to get much better of a guess or anything. 
So I might just have to guess somewhere. Go a little bit further, but... This is giving me kind of maybe central country vibes. I don't know. It doesn't quite seem like it's on the coast. So, my guess... It doesn't really seem desertous either, so... I'm just going to guess maybe rural New South Wales again. Maybe. Huh, I got a thousand points that time, but it was in Queensland instead. Okay. Alright, this is the final round of the game. Let's go. You end with the hardest one. I don't even know if there's any freaking point of going down the road. Let's just stay where we were put and try to guess from there. Desert. So this is probably like... It could be pretty much any state because they all have a big portion of desert, but I would guess the portion that probably has the most. So I might go with South Australia. Let's see. Not Western Australia. Okay. Yeah, we did not do too... Oh, yeah, we did not do too well this time. Uh, that was terrible. That was freaking awful. Okay, um, yeah, so I have I did good with every other round. Australia is still freaking thwomping me. It is a hard country because you got to guess pretty much exactly where it is. And even if you're in the same state as your guess, you could still get it wrong. So, yeah. Kind of a very embarrassing and terrible last round, but I figured we'd do something a little bit challenging and fun for the last round, so... Yeah, I hope you guys like this episode of GeoGuessr. Next time we do it will probably be in a few months' time, and... Yeah, that's about it, guys. Gaming do here. See you later, and bye.